Top 7 Viruses That Can Lead to Cancer Some viruses have the potential to disrupt normal cell function, causing cells to lose control and form malignant tumors. Research shows that over 100,000 cancer cases worldwide are linked to viral infections. According to Live Science, there are at least seven viruses known to directly or indirectly cause cancer. These include human papillomavirus, HPV, hepatitis B virus, HBV, hepatitis C virus, HCV, Epstein-Barr virus, EBV, herpes virus, human T-cell lymphotropic virus, and Merkel cell polyomavirus. Additionally, human immunodeficiency virus, HIV, increases cancer risk by weakening the immune system, which allows cancer-causing viruses easier access to the body. In 2012, viral infections were estimated to cause 10% of the 1.4 million cancer cases globally. Dr. Jay Brzozowski, a senior researcher at the National Cancer Institute, explains that viruses can trigger cancer through both direct and indirect mechanisms, with each virus acting uniquely, direct mechanisms. One of the most well-known cancer-causing viruses is HPV, responsible for approximately 37,000 new cancer cases annually. HPV has been linked to cancers of the cervix, anus, throat, penis, vagina, and vulva. Some HPV strains promote cancer by producing proteins that disable the natural tumor suppression systems in healthy cells, allowing tumors to grow unchecked. This enables tumors to grow wildly, says Dr. Harris Torres, professor of infectious diseases at the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center. Of the more than 200 types of HPV, only 12 are strongly associated with cancer. Other viruses, like EBV and human T-cell lymphotropic virus, can also directly cause cancer by rapidly multiplying cancer cells and helping them evade the immune system. Several factors affect the likelihood of a virus causing cancer. For example, some strains of HPV and EBV are more likely to cause cancer than others. People with weakened immune systems are at higher risk, and additional external factors, such as exposure to carcinogens, can increase the probability of cancer development in direct mechanisms. Some viruses indirectly cause cancer by promoting chronic infections. HBV and HCV, for example, can lead to prolonged inflammation and liver damage, resulting in cirrhosis and scarring. Chronic inflammation is highly carcinogenic, explains Dr. Brzozowski. As the body attempts to repair liver damage caused by HBV and HCV, newly created liver cells may mutate and develop into cancer. HCV is also associated with non-Hodgkin lymphoma, a cancer of the lymphatic system, Due to the virus's continual stimulation of the immune system, HIV indirectly raises cancer risk by weakening the immune system, making it easier for cancer-causing viruses to attack the body. Although HIV does not directly cause inflammation, the compromised immune system leaves individuals more susceptible to other cancer-causing viruses.